Hey everybody, it's Neil. Welcome to my Tesla. And my hair's a mess, but I have this portable SSD T7 I got from Samsung and it's like uh, 500 gigs, so it's got a lot of memory. So if you've got the Tesla Model Y, the new one, it comes with just USB-C ports. So I had to figure this out. So what at first thing I had to do was I had to go uh, open the glove box. Okay, so in my glove box, there's a little USB stick, this thing here, right? I have to take this out in order to use the other one. So you, you can't have two at the same time. So this one that it came with is 128 gigs. So it's actually pretty good. Um, so I'm trying to set up the sentry mode and stuff. So um, so this one actually isn't too bad in itself, but whatever. I'm taking it out and I'm putting in my 500 gig Samsung hoopajoop, whatever it is called. Okay, so I'm closing up the glove box. And so you can't, you don't put this back in the, you could use probably the USB one with the USB, but now we've got USB C's. And so we got to connect this thing up and where it is, I couldn't find it. I'm like looking all over for this USB C port. And where it is, is you know, you have that little center console thing, right? Uh, right there, this thing, right? So you open this up and like normally you'd think it would be the, at that way, but it's not, it's actually on the wall here. If you feel for it, you'll feel there's little, there's little slots for the USB-C and then you stick it in one of those slots. So here I'm sticking it in there right now. So there, now I'm plugged into the USB-C and you can tell cause the little light's on, right? So now what I have to do is I have to go into my screen. I don't know if you can see, hopefully you can see it. And I'll go here and then I go to safety and security and you scroll down and then you got to format the USB drive. So you format it and then that's what's going to get it set up to go. So now I'm set up and you see, I've got the little, I can close this and now I've got the little camera up here. So I have the sentry mode so I can see like launch my viewer and well, there's no dash cam footage because I just formatted it, but eventually there will be some and then there'll be some footage there. So that's how you're going to get to it, is clicking on that thing up there and then launching the viewer. There might be some now because uh, we've been in here for a few seconds. Nope, still not yet. But that's the whole concept of it. So there you go. That's how to set up that sentry mode on the newer Teslas that just have the USB-C ports and not the USB ports. So I'm going to put a link, though, to this Samsung drive that I got that everyone recommends and says is good. So you can get one for yourself and like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I'll be back with some other things to review soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.